by like having range, like stood on their own little conveyor belt because there's 20 conveyor belts, not like little ones, like little blocks. So you could try with like range spread out on each one of them, see if that affects how many come down or how fast or what order. The room wasn't split in two, really. But there was room on both sides, yeah. Just go uh, groups one and three to the left, group two and four to the right. And let's see if we're a bit split, if the... Yeah. Should we maybe just make a line here and try that out? And then just go forward as a group? Can the person who's pulling pull from the middle? Or? Is anyone going to put stuff in the middle? Well... It jumped, yeah, they yeah. leap to wherever it pulls. So either way, I'm gonna have to go to the left side to pull it all the way to the right. So there's probably a maximum number of things yeah. that can be done. And that's all already. the one it seems. Okay, standing in between seems to kill you. <laughs> yeah. So, so what's the <laughs> point if, if the second time they come down, the whole room is filled? Yeah. It doesn't make any sense at all whatsoever. Is there any other place where you can stand in this fucked up room? Uh, Just one scourge. Was there one uh, on the other side? Yeah, you okay, now they go away. So. Uh, after the, the seconds ones come down, after one or two seconds, the other ones, like the previous ones, go up. Because, well, everyone was pretty much stood in two groups, like two full groups. Just try and, like, completely spread, like, everyone, like, five yards apart on their own little conveyor belt. Because it's 20 little conveyor belts. If all the range is spread out, see if that affects it. Because the last pull, we were much more spread out than the pull on this one. I think we have a, a certain tactic though, we could just do those snake lines, like we did before, just for them spread out and just having two different sides of the room for each one. Yeah, but it totally depends though, because this pole was totally different to the last one. Last, last time we had a third of the amount of it did this time. But it's only uh, positions where people stand where they sat, so we can totally That's control it. No, no, they're no. coming where people are not standing as well. Yeah. Really? I yep. yep. Yes. yes. <laughs> That's the whole issue. That's why I, I said, that. just try spread out, like if you're ranged or a healer, and stand on your own little square, see if that affects it. I see people moving like chickens, so I never see it in, uh, one spot that was never seen, but okay. To test it out, spot where people definitely won't go, they just run random on, on the side, and we can just check. Doesn't even matter which one. Just a corner or order. Just mark one, just one to skip. So I still think it's only where players stood that right? can. It's definitely, definitely, definitely not. not. Yeah, I think so too. I reckon we best trying to pull where everyone's spread. But maybe it yeah. helps if we're. Everyone spread out, try that. I'll just let's give it a go. That doesn't really help on the mini mechanic though.
and he just randomly killed my pet. This plot up is going to be safe until they vanish. Then I think the other side will probably be safe. Really How many mad. safe spots have we got now? Can't Which see. Because I can see two. Um. I just watched some guys three. on the stream doing it and they're all just staying three, as a group and four. moving along. I mean, this is just stupid. If you get trapped in between two and then you're a ghost light, there is nothing to do. Are you guys sure there is no pattern? I mean... We can't there's no this. pattern, but there's a way of controlling it. Yeah, I'm sure there's this way. Yeah. I honestly don't see anything that people haven't stood on before going down. We need to move as a group, like, like I just saw some group do it on stream. So. You can do it with one group and move along like every fucking possible yeah. fight. Or you can have three people just going full lanes and then the rest of the group just one lane and then you end up having three safe spots on the one lane the whole group is on. The group I was just watching, they were just waiting until like the the like stomper thing comes down, like waiting and then just moving to the next platform, like moving quite slowly. Yep. And they was moving yes. as one group. There's uh, different colours so it's light first and a bit more and a bit more. Yeah yeah. yeah. Yes, two, uh, twice it goes brighter, or once at least, before it comes on. It's, it's twice, twice before, before. it's like there's like activation, then there's like the second one, third one, and then it slams. Yep, so we can stay longer on one. But then we have to spread out a bit. No, not really. The shadow? We don't? Okay. Does it stack uh, or not? What? Well, the more the more stacked you are, the more you're gonna get the jumps. And more, the more, more people you're gonna. Yeah. Well, then you have to do it with group two groups, and everyone always goes the same uh, yep. place. Just do that. Just do that. Just move as group and do the zigzag line, and just meet in the middle. Like only move if you have to. So yeah, groups one and three left, group two and four right, and move as a zigzag. Stay, use one plate at a time. Stay until it's like the second light up, then move back. <clears throat> yeah, rather die than moving only, just for practice. Well, what pattern do you want us to do? Do you want us to meet on the same safe spot in the middle? Uh, yeah, do go all the way back, then go one in, then go start going forward. You basically want to start, say, on moon, on moon, you want to start there, then where I am now, then this one. Yeah, exactly. And then you move then, one in. Then back in, like yeah. that. Yeah, exactly. Okay. <clears throat> so then why is everyone here? Aren't we splitting? Yes, groups one and three left, it's group two and four right. We can probably even start the one on the plates that they're on. Just pull them and then move on to that plate. So the they're only jumping to the middle. Or well, where they pulled, so... Yeah. Yeah, but they will come to that plane. It's not I'm gonna need like a misdirection or a trick or something on one to get to the right hand side, otherwise if I run over I'm just gonna activate like the safe spots pretty much. Who's that, sorry? Uh, protection. Hands go. Alright, protection. Stand on moon. If you're not stood on moon you're gonna fuck it up straight away. Don't move body, my mother. Get on the fucking star. Yeah, cross. Yeah, someone moved early. Just move all and the way pets. across. Oh, it might be the pets that are moving there, actually. Try to miss him. Half of the group was fucking AFK on that uh, platform. Mm -hmm. 
can you try dismissing your pets? So we're just super safe because I saw a wolf just mm -hmm. moving through one uh, exactly after someone came. So basically, you just don't move off your square unless it goes bright orange. Yes. Don't run ahead of people. No, but you're supposed to start uh, like one, like you're meant to start on their on their positions. No. What we'll detox it actually? Why don't we just move as one? No, better. Because they jump. If you get two jumps, they're the same. I just watched some group on stream do it, and they all just moved as one big solid group, and they move slowly. So like when the thing. Instantly die. It doesn't change anything. It doesn't matter if you have two groups or one group. That's a maximum. Yeah, but you're number. gonna have more of the room to move around, aren't you? Like they don't jump no. two groups. They don't jump in that phase anyway, though, do they? They only they do. jump in the. Do they? They, they, they jump do. every phase. Just do this, it has nothing to do with that. Just don't move early, don't move your pets, watch out. Don't seek that, don't do stupid stuff. Good, I'll go mark The most important part is not to move early. And for this practice, it doesn't even matter if you move this group or not. I mean, if you change to a big group later, that's the same thing. And moving as a big group just makes uh, the face last longer, basically. More time to deep spend the end. Yeah, but I just watched a guild just push it into the next transmission doing that, so it isn't a problem. It doesn't matter for practicing. Whatever you do, just. Do one thing. Yeah, yeah but you've got people people. stood on random platforms like all around there. Which yeah, means that doesn't help like... that group either. So just don't do that. It's the same thing. So just start and be on the same platform. If you do it properly, same, same, same thing, but it uh, goes faster. I mean, like the face, the yeah, yeah, shift yeah, comes down faster. Yeah, we can change that whenever. I mean, just practice this standing for now. Can so we just have a fucking pull where we don't stand spread out wherever the fuck we want and actually be on the same bloody plate? Thank you. Um, I'd really suggest uh, dismissing pets for now, since they may fuck it up, I'm not sure yet, but we can test it later. I'm pretty sure and that a hunter pet did activate one on the right hand side as well. Be ready to move on to your respective markers. Can have a misdirect or tricks or whatever again. Get on purple. Get on moon. Where, where, where? Now. They start lighting up as soon as someone walks over it. That's what happens. So yeah, you, you just do this. Look, this so is right. You just gotta move slowly. Yeah, the right pretty much just move out when once. it gets right. So, so when it's when, it. yeah, when it started, if someone just touches another plate, you basically screwed that plate over for later. Yep. We were totally free on the right side. By the way. Mm -hmm. We only had to move once. And can we not have ninja pulls? Because it fucks it up completely. Because they jump on one side. And yeah, the jumping, it it seems to start after a while actually, the plates, so we have plenty of time to move and you probably can pull from You have like area. 10 seconds to get on the correct mm -hmm. plate at the start. So tanks can even pull from somewhere else if they want to have the jumping better. Oh, well, I think well, it's ninja pulls. Well, we... I'm trying to, to get it in the middle, so yeah, there have. Yeah. It's exactly the same distance to both sides, but yeah. But Someone always pulls. It's like simply Kevin. activated by touching the plate, so everybody needs to move onto the next plate at the same time, and then the next plate at the same time. No one's allowed to you stray off the plates. Uh, and you don't have to you go move the out the of the plate. Yeah, instead yeah between well. between them as well, it seems near. Like at least it seemed like if you go between, it just lights up the next one. Mm-hmm. So... 
It's gonna be funny in a fight. Like I was saying, it's actually a good idea. Just it's nothing like this. This this is totally different to her her rank. It should be like this in LFR, it would be fucking fun. <laughs> like Bracken's bar. Shouldn't have nerfed that. Bracken's bar got nerfed to ground. They should have left as it was. Well, they should have cut the HP. <sighs> that was stupid. Jack, congratulations, you got a mark. Might as well promote back to Raider. Promote him to uh, Triangle. Ember, go to the right marks. That's not. Someone pull. Doesn't matter, to come to marks. Get on the marks, do not touch other plates. Oh, what the hell? What? Move on to the next plate now. Oh, no, okay, it, it, yeah, it yeah, yeah. Like there's one more. Yeah, yeah, there's one more. Someone's popped up. There's people on the right hand side yeah, it's moving three. straight away. It's three, yeah. What so the hell? Why did, aren't we getting that here though? <laughs> it seems to like it likes I, to do I it on there. Early. I moved on early, so hold up. What the hell? It did that before as well, but uh, and it looks like they doesn't ma uh, matter where well uh, where you pull from. They jump to the largest cluster. Mm -hmm. So spread out and pull, then quickly move to the positions. Mm -hmm. What the hell? Why didn't he put the stuff here? It did that on the other side last one. Oh, so you can actually completely avoid being. Uh, if you off. find the safe spot. So I mean, uh, he tries to jump on you, but if you move away from no. the initial spot, they will you will evade it. Because there is an achievement as well, so it must be true. Are we doing the achievement here, by the way? <laughs> <laughs> if you do it right, you do the achievement. Actually, just doing the counter normally anyway. If everyone's playing perfectly. Most clutch slider ever. But I think we were good on the left side this time. People were way too twitchy on the right hand side. Like people, some people ran as soon as it lit up. Some people I went went to early the because middle. a certain person was not on. That like you can just group. back bed all the whole fucking way. Yep, pretty much. And it's actually better, except if you're a caster, then yeah, it sucks. Well, as a caster, you just move to the edge, and yeah, when you actually have to move, you have to move like one step. The, oh, well, depends a bit how fast they're coming. By the way, can we have like not have DPS trying to like precast and shit? Because it's not like you actually DPS in this boss for a race or actually trying to kill it. Get pull into the middle, nice and simple. is on the other way or so. Just go. Just don't do damage at the start. Yeah, just wait a few seconds. Damage map doesn't matter at the moment.
Ow. Ow. Okay. Yeah, that happened to me last time. Someone's fucking nuking that while I'm trying to move it. <laughs> but that just lit, lit up without anyone being there. Yeah, that's yeah. Really it cool. lights up. Also, people close, running so in front of other people, so it's just yeah. completely yeah. fucking retarded. See? Like, See, look, why would you just not move as one group and then we could all control it a lot better? The thing is that it, actually no one was on that. No one. It, it's, it's already if you're close. It's already which if you're one? Close. The second on which one, side? On the second one on the moon side. Because on square, it, we weren't on it as well, and it was already lighting up. I stepped up. on it, I stepped on it. it yeah. Oh. Yeah. If, anyone it was... hmm? if anyone steps on a plate, once the... I don't know how long until the activation of the plate starts, it's gonna trigger. Well, I stepped off it as, like, I don't know, a second before the thing it came down. But does it also activate if you're just close on the other plate to the edge, or you have no, to be actually? You must have touched it. Okay. It happens with three in a row, though. But yeah, I guess something went wrong. That's not true. If you activate four at the same time, they'd probably all come down at the same time. I don't think it's limited to one coming down at any one time. It's just dependent on. When you when it's activated, what I notice it's already if you're standing close to one, like if you're standing here, if you see the gnome, if you're standing here already, even though you're on this plate, this one might activate already. So I think it's already uh, it's proximity based too, am I? If you stand in between, does it activate too at the same time then? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, if you like, if you yeah, like, like, so like this, it's just well. activating, but like, if people move as like one group, then we can go, oh, let's move to the next plate, keep moving, keep moving, you know what I mean? Just worry about surviving. But I don't see why we're having to split up into two groups, it makes no sense at Because all. if the two bosses decide to jump on the same person, then we will yeah, fucking but, die. But they won't jump on the same person. If like the two tanks are like split up, like say like we're on this they're platform and we're stood tanks. here. They're not they jumping are, on they tanks. are. Like it's whoever pulls oh, no. first. He was jumping on me, don't tell me that. Look, just go out the room then and I'll pull and you watch him jump on me. Yeah, because you pull, that's the initial jump, and then they will jump anyway, and when the fight progresses, they will jump even more. Because I mean, the more rage they have, the more jumps they will perform, and they will not jump solely on the tank, they will jump randomly around, around people. For well, testing, it doesn't really matter. I mean, but it, it doesn't matter at all the if it's is the same. Yeah, one group or two groups. If we change groups. to one later, we do yeah. that later. That, I mean, that doesn't matter. Z buff will kill us. Like the ninja pulls now. This matter, so. I never even touched anything with him. Can someone reset? Uh, one has a teleport. It seems to be jumping on it's... the left side all the time, though. It never has jumped on the right side. Yo, you can actually exploit this, like, if you, you know, like, where the fire is? Okay. Sorry, I actually but... got hit. For like 160k and I survived it. Okay, the thing is, like, can you see me here? Uh, like, can you mark me, please? I'm zealous. Yeah. We all have assist. Yeah. Anyway, if you stand here, this one activates. So yeah, you have to be on it. You actually have to be on the belt, not in between, not on the edge of anything. Yeah, because, like I said, I have it right now. It's so annoying. I don't think so. I don't think we're missing anything. You yeah, just move properly. There might be ways to pre-activate stuff you don't want to be on once on, but it's a bit random anyway, so... Like, we could be split out on a whole row at the start, which we don't want, but I don't think it makes much of a difference in the end. Anyway, the the main thing we have to train anyway is the moving properly and not pre-activating stuff. And everything else can still be changed after. Yeah, 
Yes, the edges are a bit weird. You survive them sometimes, but you're still stuck on them. Um, can one of the pet classes put a pet on a random tile and try out AFK. the pets to get affected? Like just put it in, I don't know, here so. Just uh, have a hunter pet down and say, or a wall of pet and say stay here so. Awesome, thanks. Um, and I can see if that is affected or not. If we make it through this one, how, how are we gonna move as a group? Because uh, um, the other group is gonna meet with us at some point, isn't it? We'll meet in the middle on yeah. the same spot. If no one goes in the middle, they shouldn't activate, so they should be the last spots uh, active. And I mean, one and from might have that, more where active do we ones. go? Um, Back to the marks later. All right. Just the same way again we came from, I guess. If we get that far. Don't ninja pull. Get onto the spots fast. Why can I not? I'm not generating any threat whatsoever here. Like, none. Wait, one more light up. Move. Now move. move. Okay. I can't even out threat Heimdall. I'm doing like 10k here. Uh, team I'm standing here, okay, so. Yeah, I can't. I can't. I'm mashing everything. It's just Mendetta, Mark for Death. I think it's a certain person that gets attacked. Check his debuff. Just completely change the mechanics. Yeah, now. did they did they fought fix the fight? <laughs> I think no. they broke the plates. Oh, space. What Are we trying to oh. stand the same boat? Oh, yeah. Uh, I need to... Okay. I don't think uh, I'm dead now for no reason. Oh, what? What's up? It's next phase, man. Pop tarts. Oh, pizzas. <laughs> I just right. the phase. Tarts. We're missing a boss. Oh, he's out there doing shit. Oh. Do we have res? Left. Oh shit, oh shit. We need easy first, what the hell? This is pretty this, cool. This is like easier than the heroic best thing. The pizza is still okay. okay. Guys, I have a Ooh. genius idea. Levitate. Uh, well, we tried it, we tried it on heroic. It as soon as you work. take damage, wear it off. Um, Just stand between I don't, the I didn't think guys, you guys with levitate. Didn't take any damage whatsoever. Do you stay still though? Yes, no. it stands still if you stay really? between the conveyor check, belts. Check this out, check this out. Oh, yeah, yeah, between the conveyor belts. But... Just don't get hit by the pizzas and you're fine. Okay, I think they did something wrong. Someone fucked up. I mean, there has to be something, but either this try or the one where they just spam everything down. Did you see the debuff now, Mark, for that? I think that's a certain no, 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 person no. being targeted. Not either way, though, my threat right. is pretty poor. I think Can't it's still because ZZX was the worth of fire triggered uh, pressure play. So, for how long do we do this? Till they have zero HP. <laughs> I think it was uh, 45 no. or something. It's a For, oh, it's 65. It's four. Or 55. Let me check.
This fight seems to be pretty retarded. Uh, 65%. Then here he goes to the next fight. So there's only one guy and the other guy's throwing pizzas at us? No. <laughs> Not pretty much, yeah. Yeah, there's gonna be one guy, I think. Yeah, the other guy seems phases. to be doing yeah. something back there. This part of the fight actually seems fun. Yeah, it's not all I that mean, bad. They go slower than on heroic. Well, it seems that they came back and they are still at uh, some Is this the random system. pattern or is it the same no, as it's, first it's phase? Back it's, first. it's back to the first one. So, yeah, that's the fact. GG. Do I need to do they tell you I want to reroll me leave for what? Like, there wasn't any tiles this round. That's <laughs> yeah, the okay, thing. there wasn't tiles. <laughs> we got one on the left. Yeah, it's like one, and then it's got like. <laughs> Sup, guys, be AFK. And then they transition. Yeah, uh, maybe they hot fixed it and they made it, like, really easy. I think so, too. I or mean, they broke it, it by accident. I think they broke it. That's just more reason. This happened one. once before already, like. Yeah, like, yeah, like I know. Seven tries ago. Like it's some got a bug or something, I guess. I, I mean, they hotfix and stuff all the time, but I think they hotfix something and broke it. Maybe just, like just, just watch them come down, like splam, splam, splam. This try. Maybe they, they they don't want them to just come down endlessly, but they want like five of them or have them on each side. I, I know, but I'm, I'm pretty that. sure the way it's meant to work is what we were doing. That you light up one, you move, wait till the end, move to the next one that lights up. That's the way it's meant to work, but it's just bugging out a lot. I mean, it would make a really good fight in a sense for Mythic if you had only like three tiles that you couldn't light up. They would, you would have actually have to like do the cutting properly, yeah. and you could prolong that phase in a sense. Yeah, and Maybe if someone steps wrong, that. they wipe us. No, no. Maybe they decided to test it far. Yeah, that could always be that they want to test the pop tarts and people too many people fail at the other bit. Yeah. Let's see. The steep of kinda hurts. Get on the belt, probably nerfs your way too close to Don't the... Don't go so fast, please. Sorry, my bad. It was a bad roll. We're uh, not doing anything that. on this side. Something's going wrong. <laughs> I shouldn't roll. I will not do that again, so... We have nothing on this side at all. This it's random, but it's really so. weird. It's not weird, well, it's, a no random, here, at least. it's a random uh, thingy where someone stands on. Um, Half the rate needs to do to it. Fixed. If we want it slower, we could stand on more tiles at the same time, but then we have less control over where stuff comes on. What do you mean slower though? Oh. Slower per group has to move, so if you are, have more people on more tiles, it will be slower per person. It's not, it's not. It's not done like that though. It's done by how many times you move on the platform. Like if more people are moving, then it will trigger it quickly. That's like why I was saying if you move as one group, then you know what I mean. Like, cause all you got to do is the tanks just stand out. Everybody stays stacked in one place. Let the tanks pull. The tanks pull it to like say where I'm jumping now, and then all we got to do is when the pad light lights up a bit more, it's just move along. Like it gives us the whole room in case things get too panicky. Like I was just well, stood out the room there. And that's exactly that's what we're doing, but with split into two. It doesn't make any difference for yeah, but one or like two. If, if people are over at moon and people are at blue, then they're out of healing range where we could just have everybody in healing range and heal everybody. But don't take the there, there is no damage. There is the healing isn't the issue here, the really. Saying. It's just people that either fail at moving or fail moving too quick. That's all that's happening. Yeah, but if, we're, all, if we're moving as a group, then everybody can see like who's moving and when to move with one marker. Mm -hmm. Again, I failed at moving. I rolled, so overshot. 
so my bad. But when we move, like, sub we have two separate groups, but, um, at least one group can DPS while the other yeah. is moving. Yeah, but it's, it doesn't doesn't matter about DPS. You're going to be DPSing on the move, you know what I mean? Like, moving along the boat, like, slowly. You're not going to have to, like, you know what I mean? Just because we're all stood in one place, it doesn't mean it's going to instantly come down. Like, I don't get where this whole, like, pressure thing is coming from. Like, I'm speaking to friends and they're saying they're having 45% wipes on it and they're moving as one group. So... It's just an idea, I'm just being honest with you, trying both, to like, get some solid tries saying, in. Both of what you're saying is exactly right, it's just, you can do it either way, it doesn't matter which way it's done, it's just as long as people don't fuck up respective to what they're actually supposed to be doing. Try some, don't move on the plate at all, until you have to move. On blue, we're gonna have to go right now, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Okay. When Don't sit too close to the edge, though, guys. You mean left? Uh, oh, it depends already. on which way you're facing. Well, we're going to the one next to us. If this ever lights up. But aren't the people in between going to trigger it? If it was. No. To no. Run? Okay. Did do before, but not now. Move or maybe they just disabled it. I don't know. This seems wow, really okay. weird now. But it's like only two thousand. I'm good. I'm good. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, just move. Go to them. All right. Yeah. Roar. Thanks. Stop moving, fat. Yeah. You don't need to move like two blades ahead. Yeah. Don't, don't panic, we, we move as a group, it's, it, you can see when it's gonna drop down, it's so bright, you can see it, no need to hurry before that happens. And this is like one of the fights where you absolutely don't want to fucking roar. Yeah, but if you keep them together as well, can't all the melee just cleave as we're moving anyway, so that's just, the odd, you know what I mean, you're gonna push that transition.